Growing your own food can prove to be a little overwhelming at times, especially when it comes to growing tomatoes. If you find yourself with a massive harvest of tomatoes, or even just like this colander full of tomatoes that I have, it's not even completely full, um, and you're thinking, what am I gonna do with all these tomatoes before they go bad? Maybe you've never canned tomatoes before, you don't really know how to preserve them, um, or maybe you just don't have time to do the task of preserving the tomatoes right away. Well, I found this really neat method of freezing your tomatoes with the added benefit of their skins just slipping right off uh, from Jess at Roots and Refuge Farm. She calls it the core and score method, and it's really as simple as that. I just core out the tomato using a knife and this straw here, and I've scored it on the bottom in a little X, and that's it. <laughs> uh, just put it inside of a little baggie, put them in the freezer, and then when you're ready to use them, you just thaw them out and the skins will peel right off. I'll show you guys that part in just a second. Here are all of my cored and scored tomatoes ready to go in the freezer. And here they are all thawed out and ready to use. I just thawed mine out in the refrigerator overnight. Um, as you can see, there is a lot of extra water from the tomatoes that are in the bag. So be sure to use your tomatoes within a day or two at most. Um, otherwise, from what I've seen on other videos, people say that they can get moldy. I was so surprised at how easily these things slipped out of their skins. I've never actually preserved tomatoes. Um, my next batch that I have in the freezer right now uh, will be used to make some um, like homemade rotel because we use a lot of peppers and tomatoes um, in our cooking. But um, right now I just made some hot sauce just to you know try out the method and see how it worked out. And it did not disappoint. Like I said, I've never preserved tomatoes before. So this really took away the fear and intimidation of the boiling and blanching method. Um, and it also took away the overwhelm of having the tomatoes um, that I could just do something with them right away and then get to them when I actually had the time to do the canning. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.